What's up everybody, my name is Jeremy Jones and I am back with another video. Today, we're talking a Nike KD4 Aunt Pearl. So stay tuned. Hoping one day I'ma get it all right. Brother is engaged, but I started my own life. Yeah, I haven't had a chill day. Really wanna vibe, appreciate the moments. I've been creating, not scrolling. Mom and dad still support it. All right, man, I'm back with another video now. Before I get too deep into this video, y'all already know what to do. Go and hit that like button. It really helps the channel out. And if you know, consider subscribing. I make content about sneakers. All right, so let's dive into today's video. Just like I said in the intro, man, we're talking a Nike KD4 Aunt Pearl. All right, man, we're gonna be keeping things very simple over today. We're gonna be answering the basic old question. Are they drip or skip? Let's just keep it there. All right, so first things first, these are set release October 25th to the best of my knowledge, coming in a retail price of $140, right? Okay, and of course, you know the kid glance at the resale price, and right now, it look like they're averaging slightly above retail at $150 and up, depending on the size, right? Okay, now, if you see, feel like you've seen this sneaker before, obviously you have i think the last time these dropped was back in 2012 but don't quote me on that i honestly to keep it a hundred i don't even own a pair of kd's now i believe kd stands short for kevin durant right okay so these are his sneakers to the best of my knowledge i'm pretty sure if i get them wrong y'all will feel free to correct the kid down in the comment section now like i said last time we seen these joints was in 2012 now this obviously pays homage to his aunt pearl who passed away i believe to the best of my knowledge in 2000s right okay and i'm gonna read it on the sneakers app just to make sure for the smart guys in the back because like you can just eat, read the information on the sneakers app and blah 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 but it don't always tell you this one it actually does but it don't always tell you that sometimes you got to put in your own footwork smart guy but anyway we're gonna bring it back here. Nothing shots at the people that are reading the comment section because y'all know I read all the comments. But yeah, even on the back of the shoe, it obviously has pearls on the back of it. So obviously, she was a big inspiration, a part of uh, Kevin Durant's life to the best of my knowledge. So yeah, I'm gonna pull out my handy dandy phone and we'll see what it is now. Like I said, all pink, I think it pays homage because if I'm not mistaken, she's passed away from lung cancer. Again, I did just enough research just to be dangerous, but we're gonna see what the sneaker apps has on this. So I'm gonna look down just a little bit. Hope you guys don't mind. I don't really like to do this, but I'm not gonna read the whole thing, but pretty much from what it says from this, it says, this is special all pink design on an Aunt Pearl who passed away from lung cancer in 2000. There you go. Um, but inspires us all to continue to fight the fight in a cure, right? Okay, so pretty much if you look on the back of the shoe, it has pearls on it, it's all pink. Now, again, I don't really have any KDs, but I know for a fact that these have taken off. And just to confirm that retail price, I wanna double check too why I have the app open, even though technically I kinda close it. Yeah, it's 130, but I believe they're averaging 150 on the resale market. But overall, here we are, right? Now, usually I'm gonna be 100, obviously when I saw pink, Pink, um, no like disrespect, I automatically thought cancer. And let me clarify this, why this shoe kind of hits like a sentimental soft spot for the kid. Um, and I'm not going to go into details. Unfortunately, like I can relate to this situation. Not that I lost somebody from lung cancer, but I did lose somebody from cancer. It was just a different form. And they were very, very close to me. And I'm talking like, they, they're they they're on my arm. So if you know the history and you know the research and you've been watching the channel for quite some time, you know why this is kind of hit like kind of hard for me. So in any way, shape or form, the last thing I want to do is disrespect anybody when it comes to this situation because Unfortunately, I can relate, and that's not necessarily a good thing. I mean, yes, you can relate, so you know what the pink is for. For the longest times when I used to watch like football, or I see sports put on that pink, I used to be like, man, you know, and I at the time I couldn't relate, but now like I can, and you know, it's definitely a tough time. So I understand that. So Aunt Pearl was obviously one of his biggest inspiration. And say what you want to say about KD, man, you don't get where he gets by being lazy so the man put in the work and he's earned his footwork and no pun intended so i want to give him credit where credit is due overall we're going to bring it back to sneakers right quick though because at the end of the day that's what we're talking about overall i don't hate the shoe 
Um, but I don't own a pair of Co uh, KDs. I was almost said Kobe, RIP. RIP to Aunt Pearl, man, and RIP to Kobe for me even just even thinking about his name, man, because making this video really gets sentimental for me. Right? Overall, when it comes to the shoe, though, um, dope shoe. I definitely know it's gonna definitely sell out. I feel like it's done numbers back then. Now, I didn't look at what the 2012 pair is coming or uh, reselling for, but I have a feeling if they're dropping an updated version, it's probably gonna bring that one down even more. Um, just just based off of sneaker knowledge and i could be wrong so overall though for the kid though when it comes to these kd um aunt pearl um for me personally they will be a skip not a bad shoe but i really want to leave it for the true kd fans and for the people who you know obviously may have another different type of connection with these so for the kid personally these will be a skip but i want to know what you guys think down in the comment section we'll be going out to these on october 25th retailing at 130 dollars and of course let me know if you think they're drip or skip all right man i'm gonna go ahead and get up out of this thing and stop rambling man y'all be sure to hit that like button it really helps the channel out and if you know consider subscribing i made content about sneakers again my name is jeremy jones and thank you for watching and i'm out